Okay, so I have a 2006 um, 6.0 liter F350 and I'm getting ready to do the compression test through the glow plug. And what you'll have to get is a actual glow plug adapter that's specially made for a 6.0 to get it to work. And you'll also need a gauge that's going to fit that glow plug adapter. So you'll want to kind of buy those together. So um, right now I'm just getting ready to start and I'm going to go in through this first uh, glow plug port here and I'm just going to work my way back. Okay, and you can see where that port is, where I got that located. And I'm just getting ready to attach the gauge to this. Okay, so we're getting ready to crank this over here. And we're going to have to get a minimum of uh, 400 PSI for this thing to start and run properly. So we're going to go ahead and crank it at this point and see what we get. Okay, see we're not quite getting our our 400 psi and it looks like we're bleeding off there a little bit as well okay so we're going to go ahead and move on to the the second one back there and see what we get and i'm going to record this um, okay now we're on the second one back here and uh, we've gotten 360 on the the first one there um, and I don't know if I'd mentioned you just hand tighten these adapters you don't get those any tighter than just hand tight all right so we're gonna go ahead and crank it over again here see what we get Okay, now we're on the third one back, and we're going to go ahead and crank this over and see what we get. Okay. All right, so we're getting right at 400 on that one. Okay, now we're on the fourth one back. And we're going to go ahead and see what we get on this one. Okay. Okay, so we're like just barely over 300 PSI on that one. Okay, so this is our results. Um, we're looking at 360, 340, 400 easily, and then 300 on the last. So we definitely got some issues. Uh, we could very well have a bad head gasket, or we could have some seals on the injector. Injectors going in there, don't really know, but uh, definitely we're supposed to be getting like 400 PSI to run. I think they said at least 350 to 400 just to start and run. Um, and that's a big difference. We got a hundred psi difference from the third one back to the last there. So, anyways, that's how you um, check the compression by using these uh, glow plug ports. And I'd already removed them. I've got a separate video on this removing those glow plugs. So, um, anyways, hopefully that can be helpful. And uh, thank y'all for watching.